Welcome back. Thank you. Good break. Welcome. Oh, yeah. We take beer. <laughs> <laughs> I know you don't like it. Okay. <laughs> Good. Yeah. I don't like it too, but on Christmas, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm trying to force myself to drink coffee. I don't even drink coffee. Okay. Take it. Take it. Take right. your time. Mm -hmm. No worries. Relax. Okay. Mm -hmm. Relax. When you are relaxed, you learn better. Okay, Absolutely. when you are stressed, you don't learn. Okay. I tell my students, first month, just watch, 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 and just type what I'm typing. And just try to understand the concept, okay? okay. So first month is just building the concept, understanding the core concept. Okay, once you understand, you can run, actually. Once you have a good foundation on core concept of Java, actually you can do anything. You can become software engineer, you can become software developer. Okay, even you can change your track. You can say, oh no, I don't want to be. Uh, for the QA engineer or software development engineer in test, I want to become software engineer. Okay, no problem. Anyone can do it. Okay. Now, let's start from the very beginning here. I want to just take it out. So let's look, what do we have inside class? Who can tell me what do we have inside class? Metal uh, behaviors, right. properties. We have properties, okay. Mm -hmm. We have properties and we have also behaviors, yes. methods, methods, you see. We have three methods, okay. We have three methods. And what else? We have also main method, right? Main method, yeah. Main method. So this is very popular interview question. What do you have inside the class? So you have to tell the interviewer inside the class, we have properties. These are properties. Mm -hmm. Or you can say, well, we have states, we have behaviors. Then he or she might ask you, what are states? States are nothing but properties, attributes, fields. What are behaviors? Behaviors are methods, functions, actions. Okay? And they might tell you, how do you create variable? Okay. I just type what type of the data will be inside variable, okay? Data type, then name of the variable, and equal sign, then data. Data, if it is string, I put inside the inverted comma. If it is integer, I don't put inverted comma. Clear? Okay. And how do you create method? To create method, I take a keyword void, then action verb with parenthesis, because method comes with parenthesis, then a curly braces. Thus I create method. What do you have inside the method? I have statements, I have Java codes. All right, then how you can access your properties and methods. Next question. To, to access all the properties and method, I have to create what? Object, new object. Human, parenthesis, semicolon. I created new object. Now, 
from where I am creating this new object, I am creating this new object from human class. Nice. And I need a variable. We call it reference variable. So for example, this is one. H1. Since it is variable, it can be varied. It can be H1, it can be human one, it can be Rudy, okay? But remember, variable will be always in small cap. Though, if you even using name, it will be in small letter, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, since this is a drop template blueprint, you can create a number object. You can create 100, you can create million, you can create billion, okay? From one blueprint, you can create object billion, okay? So it will be two, it will be three, it will be four, okay? Four. Now, Ignatius might ask me a question. What the hell you created? New human, new human, new human, all are same. Yes, apparently all new human are same, but in practical, they are not same. Yeah. They are not same. Let us see whether they are same. I just copy one system dot out print Allen and take out, okay. I just copy H1, just print it. You see? This object is inside Java Basic. Java Basic. What is Java Basic? Java Basic package. Then name of the class. Name of the class is human. Mm -hmm. Then at the rate, and there are number. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now my question is: Are they similar? New human, new human, for new human. It looks like same new human, but in reality, they are not. Let me prove. Print it. Run as Java application. Okay, look. Are the same? No, they're not. No, they are not. They are different. Though they are created from same human class and they are inside Java basic package, still they are different. Not same. If you create billion object, billion object will be different. Not single object will be same. All right? Now, how I can multi-line comment? Who can tell me? I want to comment multi-line. Star, star slash. Yeah. And and yes. sorry, sorry, star. And and slash. star slash. Slash. Slash, right? This is, we call slash. Slash, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, no. How, why do we create object? Because without creating this object, we cannot find this reference variable. And using this reference variable with dot operator only can access all the properties and methods of the class. Okay. Now, these are blueprint, but when we create an object from blueprint, now it is physical or logical? Um, this is a 
It's logical. Logical and physical. Physical, yeah. Yeah, physical because it's now. The object. Now taking space. I showed you just. It's taking space inside computer. Right. Okay. Before you create this object, you wrote a lot of things. It didn't take any space. Inside yes. your memory of your computer. Remember, when yes. only you create object, it takes specific space in your memory Remember. of the computer, of your computer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, Babu, actually, excuse me. Uh, Babu, excuse me. Uh, before uh, you can move forward, I have a question about how do you uh, uh, copy, paste, copy, paste? Do you just do command C, V uh, to make human one, two, three, four? Yeah. Or just enter, enter, enter? Just, 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 just copy and copy and paste this. Copy is command C. Yes. Command C oh. and command V is paste. Yes. Mm -hmm. Even you can you can copy from here directly. It is on Windows is Control Alt. Just put your cursor inside two parentheses, and it is Control Alt down arrow. On Mac, I'm not sure. I'm not a Mac person, though I use sometimes. <laughs> Okay, I I believe it is commands and yeah. down arrow. No, no. Let us check. Oh, I thought I thought you're using MacBook. Yeah, I'm using Mac. Ships also not working, so it should Control be. C. No, down arrow. I want to use with down arrow. Option. No. Option is just moving. Uh, okay. Control option. No. I'm not sure what it will be in. Okay. Command shift maybe. Let me try. Command shift. No. All right, mm, let me try with the one. I think there is option. Let me try. Yeah, no, not option. Not command option. Yes, command option. You see, option commands. And it's making copy actually. Oh, just press the command option at the same time? Yes. Same time, then down arrow. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay. Oh, because I was wondering if you were doing a copy-paste and um, copy-paste, it was so fast. So I thought that... Yeah, you... I was wondering the same thing too. <laughs> <laughs> it was going so fast. If you okay. just got that copy and paste, you know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and I think you can just copy fast and furious also okay yeah. option command dance you see dance and you can just change with color braces but i don't recommend it just if you want to copy your uh, method just copy all copy Select then command C, command B, paste is command B. On Windows, it is um, control C, copy, control V is paste. Yes, paste. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Try this. Uh, actually, you need to practice to become more efficient, engineer. Okay. All right. Now, Question is, why do you create object? 
very common and popular interview question. You have to tell the interviewer, we create object to access all the properties and methods of the class. Okay. So if we want to access, meaning if we want to use these properties and these methods, we need to create object. Okay. We create object because to access them, we need the reference variable. And reference variable only can be created when you create object from human class. Clear? Now actually you can say system dot out dot print Ellen. Okay. Now you want to access name. Okay. H1. And when you put dot, you see reference variable and using dot, actually, you can access all the properties. Properties, all properties, and also methods. You see where is method, dance method, drink method. And you are getting more extra methods and properties from Java. Okay? From Java. Now, why you are creating object? Because creating object, you are opening the door of Java program from where you can access all the properties, all the methods you have created of the class. And also uh, you created properties and methods for the class. You can access them and you can also access other properties and methods from Java. You understand it? So for example, Rudy and Ignatius live in Pennsylvania close to each other. Your houses are close to each other. Hmm, Ignatius called Rudy. Hmm. Hi, Rudy. I forgot to switch on my switch on my uh, gas inside my house. There is none. And I afraid I was uh, boiling water to drink coffee. And I was in a rush. My boss called me and I just got out from my house. And now there is none in my house. Could you please check? Okay. Or could you please distinguish, distinguish or extinguish, extinguish fire, okay? Or could you please call 911 fire service, say for example, <laughs> whatever. If Rudy wants to go inside the house and want to check it, want to extinguish the fire, want to switch off whatever inside, electricity, gas, etc., 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 then what he has to do first? Open the door by, with key. Open the door with a key. Open the door. You have to have a key, key, key. for the door or you have to break it, right? So what you can yes. do? You can open the door with a key. So Creating object is opening the door of Java Horizon where it has plenty of methods and properties. So you are entering inside the 
door of Java properties and methods. Okay. So what are you doing here? You are opening the door of Java world where you can find properties and methods. You understand me? Mm -hmm. The concept is a little complicated, right? Do you understand it? Yeah you're, just, yeah, you're just saying yeah. that Java, just yeah. the basic of Java, we need the uh, we, we need key. We need to access it. To access, uh, access. we yeah, need access. to access unlock. Properties and methods. We need to unlock. Yeah. We need to unlock. So creating object, actually, we are unlocking. Okay? Just we use... H1, this is a key, and just put dot operator, okay? And it allow us to access all the methods and properties inside the Java program, and also whatever we created inside a class. You see, it's showing class name is human, and it is integer, human string f name, human integer cell in USD and you see human dance, human void, what type of void, okay? And other are from Java. We didn't create, we create only this three and this three. Clear? Is it clear? And now you can access name, you yeah. see? And now you can just copy, copy, copy. And you can access also H. You can access also whatever you have. Sell in I... USD, I think. Yes. I don't need it. Why name is, okay, I understand. No. Why he, he name is, name cannot be resolved or is not a field. I think there is no name. You see, it's F name. Mm -hmm. So there is no name. So let's double check. Yes, it is F name, this one. Okay. Now you can access it. You can access it. Right button click Java application. All right, Rudy 27 and Salary. Okay, you can make it more readable. We say presentable. How? I can say, my name is Okay, but make it a little uh, readable. So my name is what? String. So inside of the correlation mark, okay? And you can say I am okay. I make are here. All right. Now it is more presentable, more readable. You see, my name is Rudy. I am 27. I make this and that. Okay. 
Understand? Okay. Now mm -hmm. I want also to access my methods. Methods Each are one mm -hmm. dot methods are this one. Then oh, why wait, wait, no wait. Where is dance? Drink dance. Okay. And H1 is dance and what? Drink. Dance, drink. And H1 what? Sing. sing. Dance, eat, drink, eat. Okay. Eat. Wonderful. Okay, now the method, I said method is a block of code. This is block. Scope meaning block. Inside this block, inside this scope, inside this area, it can be block of code, it can be code or codes. This is one code, this is another code, it can be more than one code or program, okay? And this is only execute when called by name. Say for example, Rudy has 10 kids. If Rudy says, hey, fetch my laptop, 10 kids will look at him, but Nobody will respond because Rudy didn't mention any name. There are three methods. If you don't mention name of the method, it will not respond. You have to call by name. Reference variable dot operator then you have to call by name. Now, execute it and look. Love dancing, love dancing, love drinking, love drinking, love drinking, love eating. Even if you want to make, um, you want to make it a little different. So for example, how you can do it? You can just say here, maybe. M dot out dot print ln. It's ln. And I can just say, I'm just want to separate so that you can understand there are three separate methods. You can understand it, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I can make it maybe Another one is where? Okay. You can now differentiate. This is dense method, this is drink method, and this is heat method, right? Is yeah. it clear? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Now we have 10 more minutes only. Look very carefully. These are non static variables, meaning there is no static keyword here. I put static keywords. Now it becomes static variable. 
this variable becomes static, okay? You don't need to worry about what does static means. You are going to understand it within a couple of minutes. It is static. When I put static keyword, you know, Java does have 67 keywords. You remember, right? Mm -hmm. Static is mm -hmm. one keyword. You can that's see the, the color of the static. Yeah. Static, and these are keywords. So color when the, of the keywords. So when do we use this sta sta static word? Oh, I'm going to explain it now. Okay. So this is static. This is static. These are not static. Not static means non-static. This method is static but these are non-static now look f name has red mark okay meaning mm -hmm. f name is static right you see f name is static static does have special power is directly related to human, okay? Directly related to human and human, uh, static got power from human. So static method also got power, special power. So when it does have specific power, you don't need this. The reference variable to access it okay since static does have special power static doesn't need to create object now you see i'm not using this oh uh, let me keep it let me make it more sense i just copy it okay and make this You see, I'm not using any more reference variable H1, okay? I'm not using reference variable. And it's showing error, why? Because these are non-static. Non-static needs reference variable. Now, if I make it static, Look, I make all static, static, okay. Now look all error gun. And I'm not using this object. Okay, now these are complaining. Even I'm not using, sorry, let me, each one. Let me copy and put them also inside multi-line comments now look it's complaining right mm -hmm. why complaining because these are non-static now let me make it static let me make it static now look 
these are complaining because we don't need it anymore. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Without mm -hmm. creating object, if method are static and properties are static, without creating object, without creating object, we can access all the properties and methods because static keyword does have special power that it gets from plus. So static is directly does have connection with human with special power, extra power, clear? You see? So now interview question is, we know you said you create object to access all the properties and methods. Can't you access them without creating method? Your answer is yes or no? Yes, by means of- Yes, we can. Mm. Uh, in that case, we have to make all the methods and properties static. We have mm. to use static keyword. Make sense? Mm. Mm. So static is like a key. It's a keyword. It's a key. Java so does have, Java, Java does have 67 keywords, like public is keyword, package is keyword, class is keyword. Uh, I think uh, first day I show, you can visit to uh, Wikipedia and you can find it. Okay, clear? To understand automation, only you need this much Java mm. to understand automation. Mm. You need this much Java that I teach today in the three different sessions. Okay. But I want to teach you object oriented programming because object oriented programming, a lot of questions from object oriented programming. You have to understand it to crack the interview. But to understand automation, that's all you need to know. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. Um, Babu, um, I can I request for uh, the video of uh, this uh, class and also the last one. I I think um. It will be nice. It would be. Uh, I sent it today morning of the last class. Did you send it today? Check. Yes, I sent it today early in the morning. I got it. Yeah, I sent to every student. Okay. Now we are going to end our class today. No, I, I didn't you get don't have any questions. Anything today. Uh, please check uh, your spam folder. Spam mm -hmm. folder. Check your spam folder. All right. If you don't have question, we want to end here. If you have question, then we can reconnect again. Okay. I will just have to, you know, I took some notes. I have to read it tomorrow morning. I okay. don't think any of those. Uh... I will send it again. Thank you so much uh, for teaching no us tonight. Yeah. Thank